Hello everybody and welcome back to the Pokemon Solar Light and Lunar Dark playthrough where I have finished training up our entire team to level 77. Which was a slog, but it was a good slog. It was pretty rewarding with the shiny charm and stuff. It was, as you guys probably saw, pretty crazy. So let's go to the League Battles. Hello, can you tell me your name? Ah, you're Shade and you're on my list. Are you ready to take part in the Rakota League? Yes. Okay, I'll open the gate for you. Good luck. Da, da, da. There's a lot of people here. Okay, well, there's Rick. What, Shade? You made it to the leak too? I'm really surprised. Never thought a weakling like you could make it this far. Haha. <laughs> I just hope the other participants are not as weak as you. Huh, that'd be an easy win for me. Kira, we made it. We're in the Rakota Pokemon League. I always t thought you could do that, Rodney. Wait. Oh, okay. That, whew, that sentence threw me off there. I always thought you could do it, Rodney, but that I would get so far. That's so wonderful. Huh? Oh, it's you, Shade. You're already here. Shade, woo, this is it. We made it to the Rakota Pokemon League, all three of us. Huh? Oh, the redhead's there, too. Who, who are you calling redhead, Orangina? Calm down, boys. We've come so far and been through so much. We deserve to be here. I just hope we don't get into the same groups. I hope I win. I really want to battle the Elite Four. I'm so excited. Dream on. I'll battle the Elite Four after my great victory. Even making it this far is a great achievement. Making it to the end, well, I hope one of us does. Okay, so we'll kind of have to qualify to fight the final Elite Four. Welcome to the Rakota Pokemon League. We're ready to start, so if you'd follow me, we can get things underway. Yes, let's give it all we got. Yeah. Well, we oh, that is loud. Uh, okay, let me just get my volume controls here for a second, because dang. <laughs> Y'all need to calm down, Pokemon. No, one. There we go. Uh, welcome to the Rakota Pokemon League. We've had some exciting, intense battles to be had, so let's get started. I'll explain the rules of the league. All the trainers will be randomly put into one of four battle groups. They'll compete against each other until there's one winner in second place from each group. Then those four winners in four second place will be in the quarterfinals. Four winners of that round are into the semifinals, and two winners of that round will be in the Crota Pokemon League final. Wow. Okay, so we have like a tournament, and then we can fight the Elite Four. So let's get the battle started. We will now draw by a lot the groups. Hey, this is Group A. Uh, Pokemon Trainer Rick, Cowgirl Jessica, Fisherman Nathaniel, and Psychic Paul. We're all gonna be in different groups. We know that, right? B, Hiker Morgan, Battle Girl Carla, Fairytale Girl Faria, and Pokemon Trainer Roddy. Then it's gonna be Kira. And then it's gonna be me. Oh no, Kira and I are in the same group? Plot twist. Group D. Pokemon Trainer Kira, Punk Guy PS, Backpack Arena, and Pokemon Trainer Shade. Hmm. Guess we're knocking Kira out. We'll start with the battles of Group A. All the participants that are not in Group A, please go back to the waiting area. You can watch the battles on TV. Okay, now I can talk to people again. I'm so excited to take part in the Rakota Pokemon League. I hope Nathaniel will win his group. I'm in the next round, so I better get prepared. Okay, blah blah blah. I don't really care about anybody. This blue-haired guy, though, like, I don't know who he is. These books are great devices for battles. You need a good strategy to win the league. Yeah, okay, whatevs. Oh, we're in the same group. Luckily, two of each group get to the quarterfinal. So it seems group A is close to the end. I'm in the next group, Shade. I'm so excited. Do you think I can make it to the next round? Yes, thank you so much. All participants of group B, please come to the stadium. Oh, it's time to go. I'll win this group no matter what. See you later, Shade. Oh, there's Rick now. Talk to you. You won, no doubt. Ah, this group is so easy. I've won it without a problem. Now I'm watching the defeat of Orangina. Haha. <laughs> oh, we're in the same- oh, okay. He did it. He's in the next round. I made it to the next round. I hope Blair made it too. Start every second. I have to be prepared. Okay, do I have to talk to a certain person? Or is it a time thing? Put my two partners. Blah, blah, blah. Can I just go in? You have to wait until all the participants are here. Okay. Hmm. 
Do I just have to wait here? How long do we stand here, guys? I don't know. This is suspicious, though. Uh, what is this, PC? Oh yeah, that's right, because it says I can change my Pokemon and stuff. Oh, there we go. Okay. All participants group C, please come to the stadium. So do I just have to talk to every person, essentially, every time? Or is it just like a certain person I'm supposed to talk to? Okay, so he lost to Rodney. We're fine in my group. I can't believe it. I hope you and Kira get to the quarterfinal as well. So it's time to get prepared, Shade. I wish you all the best for your battles, but I promise our battle won't be easy for you. All participants in Group D, please come to the stadium. Here we go, Shade. And live music again. <laughs> Start with the first round of Group D. It's Pokemon Trainer Shade versus Pokemon Trainer Kira. Let the battle begin. Wait, I have to choose Pokemon? Oh. I want you. I want Marjorie. I can only have three Pokemon. Did I know this? Oh. Oh, dang. Okay. Um. Okay, Fang, yes. Marjorie, yes. Faye is really strong? Yeah, let's do that. I know they said they heal Pokemon after each battle for the qualifying rounds. So as long as we can beat Kira. Wow, they're level 65 though. Uh, Bob Liz is full of ice. Yes, that one. <laughs> so Fang was a good choice to start out. Now the battle music's gonna be really quiet. I don't know... I'm trying to decide what the best thing to do for sound here is, because that... Uh, like, anime gym battle theme is so loud. So I guess y'all just have to... kind of deal with the quiet battle music. Uh, Pixel Lily. Okay, Fang was an excellent choice. Just destroy Kira's team. I enjoyed it. Oh, okay, that was weird. It's time for the next battle. Pokemon Trainer Shade versus Punk Guy Pius. Let the battle begin. Okay, um... So did we get healed between that fight? Yeah, we did. Okay, punk guys are normally dark types. So let's get Marjorie in there and Faye as well. Right, dark and poison normally. So Fang's good against poison. As he throws out a water type. Wow. Uh, let's try assist. We have a chance of getting electric. If not, we'll throw Marjorie in after. If this goes poorly. Got the paralysis, anyhow. Uh. Yeah, Metal Burst does a lot of damage. Aha! There we go. <laughs> Nailed it. Still didn't win, though, and now we're dead. Okay. Well then. Marjorie? My dear, please. Uh, what else you got? Carbonitro, which is what? Ice fire? Uh, so let's get Faye. Faye at least has, what is it, thick fat or whatever it's called? Uh, yeah, so we're frozen. Okay, good. You can't do that to me. Yeah, Faye's pretty good against most things. And he's strong, too. 
which doesn't really seem like it right now because that had to take two hits, but <laughs> um, he's been really good in training and all that. Razadon. I uh, wish we had Fang. We sure don't. Alright, this thing has a mega evolution. It's cool that even the random trainers will mega evolve. Also, it looks like everybody's going to be level 65 in the qualifiers. So, interesting. I wonder what level the Elite Four is then. 70s? How? Last battle group Pokemon Trader Shade versus Backpacker Reyna. Let the battle begin. Oh, same group. It's been doing pretty well for me. Hypno Smog. Oh, we haven't actually seen this one yet. Um, it's Poison Psychic type. Let's Earth Power it then, I guess. Unless it has Levitate. Uh, but we saw this thing's pre-evolution in one of the caves. Okay, good. Uh, no whale. That is not a good one for you, Fang. Ooh, Waylight. Sure. That thing looks deadlier. I like that it gets multiple uh, dorsal fins, too. That's fun. And Flamenco. Easy peasy. Yeah, these things are doing pretty good damage for being level 65. I mean, like, we're 12 levels ahead and that thing just almost, you know, too shabby. Hurricane's strong though, right? It's a base 110 move. These are the last battles of Group D. We're now preparing the battlefield for the quarterfinals. See you soon! Oh, this is gonna be a long Elite Four area. Or, uh, pre-qualifiers and then Elite Four. Alright, how about you, Rick? So the quarterfinals now. Never thought you three had made it. Haha. -ha. That was a Kira one, too. I was a bit disappointed to be in the same group as you, Shade, but we both did it. I can't believe it. Wow, Shade, all three of us are in the next round. Hmm, the redhead is too, but that was obvious. He is a good trainer after all. Okay, now we announce the drawn battles for the quarterfinal. First battle is Pokemon Trainer Kira versus Pokemon Trainer Rodney. Okay, guys, take your bets now. Who's gonna win, Kira or Rodney? My vote is Rodney. One, because we haven't fought him yet, and two, because he's probably stronger than Kira. Oh, never mind, Rodney. This will be a great battle. Second battle is a Roman Lady Blair versus Fisherman Nathaniel. Third battle is Fairy Tale Girl Faria versus Pokemon Trainer Rick. Rick would actually probably struggle with that because his freaking Dinopian is Dragon type. This will be easy as always, haha. <laughs> Last battle is Artist Core versus Pokemon Trainer Shade. We start with the first battle immediately, so please follow me, Pokemon Trainer Rodney and Pokemon Trainer Kira. And now we talk to people again. So one of your weakling friends gets to the next round. That's hilarious, haha. -ha. Oh no, Nathaniel and I have to battle each other. As I thought, why do I have to battle against Blair? First quarterfinal is done. Please welcome Aroma Lady Blair and Fisherman Nathaniel for the second quarterfinal. Alright guys, who won? I've lost against Roddy, called it. But that's okay, he is really strong. Still have to train a lot. But the Pokemon League was an awesome experience. I've won the battle against Kira, but it was a really tough one. Her Pokemon are incredibly strong. As I thought, that girl is weaker than Orangina. I'm prepared for my quarterfinal. I'll give it all I have. The second quarterfinal is done. Here are the coming battlers. Pokemon Trainer Rick and Fairy Tail Girl Faria. Time for another win. Haha. <laughs> oh, I lost. Blair was too strong for my Pokemon. I'm in the semifinals. I can't believe it. Are you spying on me? I don't want to talk with my opponent. Yes, this must be Artist Cord. My strategy won't fail. Man, plot twist if Rick loses to that <laughs> fairy tale girl. 
It's time for the last quarterfinal. On the left side is Pokemon Trainer Shade. On the right is Artist Cord. Quarterfinal is a 4v4 round, so please choose your Pokemon first. Okay, good. I like having more Pokemon with me, thank you. Um, let's go Vincent. I think he's just a little bit stronger than Lunape, and he does have health regen, so... Artist Cord. Uh, Tundril. Good. Burn up. Who else we got? Swelligant. That's a good one for Marjorie. Man, a lot of these things are faster than us. Which is surprising. I know Marjorie's fairly slow, but still. Oh well. What else you got? Eclipser. Ah, uh, Psychic Rock, right? So... Vincent, I guess, with Crunch? Sure. Oh, I could use Phantom Force, too. But Crunch gives me a stab. So we're gonna use that one. And for Vesta, which is poison type and possibly a second type. Man, Lunape might have been a good choice to bring to this battle. Oh, we haven't seen that one yet. Um, poison dark maybe? So I guess Marjorie would have been fine too. How could you beat my perfect strategy? I don't know. So this was the last quarterfinal. Now we will draw the semifinals. Have a break, fans. Next battles will be 5v5. Ah, oh, good. We're slowly getting more Pokemon each time. I'm the last female in this tournament. No, you're not. I am also a female, thank you. This whole game has been telling me I'm male, and I'm not. You and the Orangita made it to the semifinal. You can both just be happy you're not facing me till now. It's time for the semifinal, Shade. Maybe we battle each other? Alright, y'all. We ready? A nugget for good luck. Thank you, Fang. Okay, here we go with the drawn battles for the semifinal. First battle is Pokemon Trainer Rick versus Roma Lady Blair. Oh, so I'm against Rodney then. Hmm, so I have to destroy one of you guys in the final. Ha <laughs> ha. Second semifinal is between Pokemon Trainer Rodney and Pokemon Trainer Shade. As I expected, Shade, let's show our skills to the world. Start with the first battle immediately, so please follow me, Pokemon Trainer Rick and Roma Lady Blair. Okay, so Rodney's going to have his water starter, so we're definitely going to have Marjorie. And then beyond that, I don't know what he's going to have. Hopefully his bird. <laughs> Alright. Made it to the semifinal, I can't believe it. Have you thought we'd get so far as when we got our first Pokemon? Final semi- or the first semifinal is done. It's time for the second one. Please welcome Pokemon Trainer Rodney and Pokemon Trainer Shade. It's time for it. I won't go down easy, Shade. No, I don't. You will. It's time for the second and last semi-final. On the left side is Pokemon Trainer Shade. On the right side is Pokemon Trainer Rodney. Semi-final is a 5 versus 5 rounds. So please choose your Pokemon. Uh, we're gonna start with Marjorie, just because she has good type coverage. I'm gonna bring Fang. Uh, let's leave Zip out for now. Because we already have electric coverage. Unless Marjorie faints, in which case we would have a problem, but... Nope, he's gonna send out Lunate first. Perfect. Uh, da -da -da -da. Easy. Yep, he brought his Budsaur. Wow, that surprises me. I mean, most of the Pokemon in this game have been pretty good, like if you raise them up levels. Uh, Bob Blaze. Oh, Bob Blaze. Um, although I do find that Zip is pretty freaking weak. <laughs> and Zip sucks to level up, for that matter. Uh, so I'm not keen on using him. But we'll probably end up using him in the Elite Four. 
I just always have Zip because he has headbutt, though, for all the trees. Nope, oh, Fang leveled up. Uh, Salad Slam, there we are. Marjorie? Yeah, like, Marjorie's already swept, what, three of his Pokemon? Or about to be three? She's been good. She's been real good. Oh, look at that. The Mega Evolution saved you. And he used Hone Claws. Wow. Congrats. Not gonna protect you from that one. And Marjorie gets a level up too. And Bulker. Last but not least, a good old Bulker. We could throw Faye in, but you know what? Let's put Lunape in. Get him a little bit of screen time. Oh, focus. What is that? Focus punch? Or it's focus something. It's the move that sucks if it actually hits you, but it almost never hits you, so. Cool. Wow, 5600 experience. I've lost. I have to accept that you're a bit stronger than me, Shade. Never mind. Congratulations. Good luck for the final. So this was the second semi-final. The participants for the final are save, are safe, I guess. Please wait a few minutes before the Rakoto Pokemon League final will start. Me and Rick. So you made it to the final, but your opponent will be me, so you won't have a chance to win the league. <laughs> wow, okay, Rick. It's time for the great final of the Rakoto Pokemon League. Please welcome our finalist Pokemon Trainer Shade and Pokemon Trainer Rick. I will win this league no matter what. Nah, Rick, I'm winning this one. Welcome to the great final of our Pokemon League. On the left side is Pokemon Trainer Shade. On the right side is Pokemon Trainer Rick. Both made it to the final, but who will win it? It's a six versus six battle, so please just choose the position of your Pokemon. Yeah. Um. Put Fang first. Why not? Just keep the order that we have. I feel like I probably should put Faye first, in case he throws out his Dinopian right away. But, whatevs. We'll deal. Alright, Rick, what you got? Miss Tablet. Hey, this is why we have Fang first, I guess. Alright. That was lucky. Fang's like the one Pokemon I have that can effectively deal with this thing. So yeah. Good job. Fang. Murder it. Please and thank you. Before it gets to use frickin' Metal Burst. Uh, Pinglade. Ice Water? Let's try Zip, I guess. He's still good, he's just not fantastic. Yeah. Still got that good elect electric moves. Uh, Natoron. Oh, I fought so many Natoron. It's just ground type though, so it's... Uh, it's not like we really have anything great against it. But I can resist it if it's trying to use Magnitude. Oh, double Edge. Interesting choice. You're gonna get double hit by that. Oh, it's got Rock Head. Never mind. Just gonna get hit by the Rocky Helmet then. Head Smash. Does that one normally have Recoil? I feel like it probably does. I'm glad it missed then. Because it probably would have been pretty strong. Ah, uh, Stegosteel. I don't know, this one's Rock Steel, isn't it? So fire is a neutral hit. Actually, if it is, why don't we power it? Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that thing is Rock Steel. Or, yeah. Uh, Caspering. All right, well, so far, Fang has been pretty much carrying the team, followed closely by Marjorie. And Dinopian, which is pretty much how it's been all along, so are we surprised? Nah. And now you can get murdered by Dragonic Glow because it's both a dragon and fairy type. Get wrecked, son. It's pretty much the only Pokemon I can use that against with any 
solid results. Alright, beat Wreck. What? How is this possible? I've lost? I did everything to be the greatest Pokemon trainer in the Rakota region, but I couldn't beat you in the most important battle of my life. You beat me in a fair battle. You're one of the greatest now. You deserve my full respect. The final of the Rakota Pokemon League is over. We have a winner! It's Pokemon Trainer Shade! Congratulations! <laughs> she now has the permission to battle Rakota's Elite Four. Good luck for that, you'll need it. Oh, hello everybody. Wow, Shade, you did it! I'm so happy for you, Shade. Gym Leader's son and now Rakota League winner. I'm so proud. Keep on breathing, Mom. This was an excellent tournament, Shade. I'd never expected that you would come this far. Does Kira not have a dad? I guess not. Maybe that or he's not here. Shade, thanks again for this great battle. I'm really proud that I could battle you in the final round. I'll go home to Lizzie's castle to train my skills. Maybe one day I can win this league too so I can battle Rex. You can visit me if you want. I'd really like to battle you another time. See you again, Roddy. Hope we'll meet again, beauty. Oh, he's not gonna call him Orangina anymore. My parents and Lizzie are waiting outside. See you at Rasset Cattle Castle, Shade. Excuse me, sir. Oh good, he didn't just shove my dad aside. <laughs> Thanks. What a nice and gentle boy. How did the brat call Kira? Cool down, Rodney. He even called you by your correct name, Rodney. Haha, <laughs> see? Even Kira picked up on that one. Being young again for just one day. Ha <laughs> ha. Never mind. Kira, Rodney, and Shade, you all did an awesome job. You started your journey with just one Pokemon, and now you are participating in the Rakota Pokemon League. Furthermore, Shade won it. For all your efforts with filling the Pokedex, I have a gift for you. But you have to come to my laboratory. We're now going home, Shade. We're so proud of you. I hope you'll give the Elite Four and the actual champions some tough battles. We'd like to watch your battles with them, but we're not allowed to enter their rooms in the stadium. If you've battled them, visit me in my gym. I really want to battle you again. Bye, darling. I know you'll come home as the Rakota Pokemon champion. So, Shade, are you going to go battle the Elite Four now? You're so lucky. I really want to battle them. All you have to do is go back to the Rakota Pokemon League building and talk to the lady behind the counter, and she'll get you ready. As Wade said, we can't go with you to the Elite Four, but we can watch your battles on the TV in the League building. We'll all be cheering for you there, Shade. Whew, okay. Um, I don't know if I actually bought any healing items. I don't remember if I did. So maybe I'll go do that first. Also, did that heal me after my last fight? Uh, okay, first of all, we have full heals. Got quite a few Hyper Potions. Got 21 Revives. I might buy a couple more things. Also, yeah, it looks like it healed me. Uh, just in case we get mulched at some point. Let's just grab a couple more things. Since we have the money anyhow, right? Uh, do we have any full restores? Oh, we have 13 full restores. Okay, wow. I think we're set for those then. 30 revives should probably be good enough. If we die 30 times, there's some shenanigans going on. Okay, uh, we're gonna save again. I just, I mean, I don't think anything is gonna crash. Nothing's crashed so far, but just in case. Welcome back, Rakota League winner. Do you want to battle the Elite Four now? Are you really ready to battle them? Yes. Okay, I'll open the gate for you. Good luck. Okay, is the music gonna stay decently quiet now? Yeah, okay, I'm gonna turn my volume back up just a smidge here. Uh, back to the level it should be at. <laughs> okay, this is Rocco. So Fang is pretty much gonna have to carry this one, I think. Hey, you made it! I knew you'd make it here! Are you surprised? Haha! <laughs> I'm a member of the Elite Four! I never told you before because I wanted it to be a surprise. Anyway, let's get professional. As you know, my name is Rocco and I specialize in rock-type Pokemon. They're strong and sturdy and can be hard to beat. I'm about to rock this battle. Get ready. Oh, I have to choose again? Ah. Oh, okay, it's just choosing order again. Oh, we got different music. This is a good track so far. Oh, they're only level 66. Alright, let's go. Lion thing versus lion thing. Mine's better. 
What? Sturdy? Sturdy. Oof. Ah, uh, that's not good. Okay, well he doesn't have a full restore. Okay. Volcadon? Oh, we saw the little volcano thing. Is that what this thing evolves from? It must. This is also some sick music, by the way. Intense. Uh, Kakaroko, which is grass rock? Yeah, grass rock. Um, let's throw Marjorie in for some bug buzzing. Yeah. Uh, Gibraltar, rock bug. Uh, fire's a neutral hit. Flying's a neutral hit. Ground is a neutral hit. No, wait. Ground super effective? Maybe? I guess we're gonna find out. Nope, ground's a neutral hit. Okay. I'm surprised that fainted that one. Fang is getting all the levels. Bulldoys. Water rock? Okay, this is risky. Oh no, it's the tortoise one. Oh, you know what we are gonna run out of though? PP for our moves. I don't think we have that many ethers. Uh, Glossus, which uh, becomes fighting rock, I'm pretty sure. All I know is that Fairy's super effective against it. Pretty sure it was fighting rock. All right, one down. My rock's broke. Wow, what a great battle. Even my strong rock types are no match for you. Maybe you have what it takes to make it to the champion. Well, we're done here. You can move on to the next member of the Elite Four. Oh man, we're gonna crush Rex, aren't we? With Fae. Alright, let's do some healing. Okay, well we do have four max ethers. We have three elixirs. One regular ether. We should be okay. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll use a hyper. Just note to self, Fang is probably going to run out of PP. Who's next? Is this Psychic? Ghost? I don't know. Who are you? Hmm, looks like I have company. Hello there, my name is Nora. Oh, normal. Normal type specialist is the Elite Four. We don't have any fighting moves. While normal type Pokemon may not be effective to any other type, they have a wide range of attacks that can be very unpredictable. With all my years as a detective, I've learned to match any types that I may come to battle with. Get ready, trainer, because this is going to be a rough ride. Okay, um, should we put Lunape or Marjorie up first? Let's try Lunape. I don't know if she's just going to use straight up, like, normal types, or if she's going to have, you know, like, normal dark or normal something. I don't know. We'll find out. Normal flying she'll probably have at some point. Okay, this thing is straight normal type, though. Ooh, wow. That did nothing. Hmm. Uh... Yeah, it's just gonna destroy me anyhow, so... Moonblast? Okay, so we gotta use some physical attacks against it, I guess? Who's a good physical attacker? I mean, technically Faye is, but Faye has, like, no physical moves. Is Marjorie? I always forget if she is. No, she's a special attacker. Um, hmm. Oh, Vincent is, of course. Duh. Crunch. Alright, uh, Bolson. Also just a normal type. Wait, not just a normal type? Oh my god, this whole time it's been weak to dark? Wait, Spir Spirix? What? Okay, well we accidentally just one-shot something that we weren't supposed to. Uh, 
it had illusion on it. Okay. Uh, we'll have to look that one up in the Pokedex after because I don't remember what a Spirix is, if we've seen one. But yeah, Bolson is just normal type. Okay. <laughs> I'm not going crazy. He strikes down. Sass Crush is part fighting, I think. Dark type? I don't know. Regardless, Moonblast is going to be good. Nice. Take that one down, Faye. Uh, and Molson, of course. Yeah, go on. Waste your turns. Flail, who? That could get dangerous. Alright. Uh, Formling. What is a formling? What? I wonder if that's like a ditto. Oh god, and I have Fey out? I have regrets then, if that's the case. Yeah. This must be this region's ditto, because I haven't found anything like a ditto yet. What an exciting case! Man, Nora's cool. Why have we not seen anything of Nora? She's a freaking detective. Okay, solved. That was no match for you. You've won this battle. You can now go on to the second last member of the Elite Four. Good luck. Uh, alright. But, Moonkey fainted. Er, Moonape. I keep calling him Moonkey. He has not been a Moonkey for a while now. Heal you. Everybody else is fine. Faye took a little bit of damage, but he's got leftovers. Do these tell me who's in each room? Oh yeah. Fayette. Fairy type. And then Rex. Oh jeez, fairy type. What's good? Oh yeah, steel and poison. Hmm. Oh boy. Well, Marjorie, you're up, I guess. Isn't this lovely? Traders, come to see me. My name is Fayette. Although most of the fairy types in this game have dual types. I'm a fairy type specialist of the Elite Four. I just love fairy type Pokemon. They're so cute. But don't mistake their cuteness for weakness. Even the smallest fairy can defeat the biggest dragon. Don't underestimate me. Okay, Marjorie. Badoop. Leap for Fayette. Yeah, this thing's just straight fairy. Oh yeah, so you know what's really cool about our own Faye? Is that, um... Okay, sorry, one sec. Focusing... Uh, he doesn't take any damage from dragons because of his fairy typing. So essentially he loses that weakness, which is pretty great. So, so far this lady has had pure fairy types? Question mark? I think Fox Event is pure fairy. Ooh. With high special defenses, too. Let's try Bug Buzz. Oh no, don't do that. No. Oh, and it's used to call mine, too. Yikes. Oh, that's not good. Okay. Uh, hmm. Yeah. Oh wow, okay. Uh. How about... Man, Faye's not gonna be any good, though. Vincent won't be any good. Lunape's not great, but... Uh... Oh, no, it's Dusty Dash. That's an interesting move for you to know. That's gonna do damage. But luckily Lunape has higher special defense than physical. That's gonna be a tough fight. Uh, Gulo. Part ghost, isn't it? Yeah. 
Um, so Dark Pulse then. Oh, but because it's part fairy, yeah, duh. Okay. Oh god. Oh boy. Um, okay, we're gonna use our last turn. Not bashing our face against it, because that's not working. Let's throw a revive on Marjorie. Okay, so this thing's ghost fairy. Man, is there anything else good against ghost? Is ghost good against ghost? I'm really bad with ghost type ma uh, matchups. Okay, let's think about this. Ghost fairy. You're not gonna be great. You'll be fine. Oops. Do not want my bag. And now we can't- oh no. You're not part normal. You're just electric. Alright, Zip. See? Told you to get some screen time, buddy. The love. What is this? What? Here's a Pokemon we've never seen. And it knows Heart Stamp, too. Ah, nice. Paralysis. Okay, tank this thing. Good job, Zip. Lavinrina. Part grass type. This I can deal with. Alright, second half of this battle, not quite as bad as the first. This is definitely going to be the hardest Elite Four fight, though. I don't think Rex is going to really give us any problems. Aw, the Focus Sash worked. What a butt. Make me use an extra PP on that. How dare you. Uh, Murmuring. Ugh. I don't think Murmuring can have uh, Lightning Rod. Mercedon does most of the time. But I don't know what Murmuring's ability is. Uh, that's gonna kill us. Nope, not quite. Okay. Alright. You're down. My dance will never end. That was a lovely battle. Just lovely. You beat my fairy type Pokemon, but that's okay. I'm so happy I got to battle you and have this experience with you. You can now move on to the last member of the Elite Four. Good luck. I was gonna say, I thought Lune fainted. Why is he following us? Oh boy. That's a nice graphical glitch. <laughs> Cause that's not Marjorie behind me. That's a weird one. Okay. Um. It's weird. Oh, I guess because Marjorie fainted in the fight, so the game thinks she is fainted. I don't know why I would put Lunape out, though. That is super wonky. Okay. That should hopefully fix it. Yeah, there we go. There's Marjorie. Weird. Alright. Rex. Dragon types. Shade, so here you are. You've made it all this way to me. I knew you were special when I first laid eyes on you. I just knew there was a power, a warrior in you, that was waiting to be revealed. So here we are, the final battle of the Elite Four. If you beat me, you can move on to the Pokemon Champion of Rakoto. Man, who's gonna be the champion? Because it's not gonna be Rick now, which was my guess. But I'll not be an easy opponent. Me and my dragon types are in sync. It will be a tough battle. Good luck. Is it gonna be the Professor? I have questions. Oops. Uh, confirm. Yeah, Alright, Rex. Throw your best at me. Actually, maybe don't. Maybe throw your worst at me. Hydragon. Oh, don't be faster. Don't crit me. Ready for the team sweep? Oh, sorry. Almost team sweep. Oh man, you know what I just realized? Dragonic Glow is going to be good against everybody too, isn't it? Because Dragon's good against Dragon, and Fairy's good against Dragon, so... Yeah. I should be using that. And a level up. 
Alright, what else you got? Dragofly. Oh yeah, that thing. You turn. Okay. Now who are you gonna throw out? JK, it doesn't matter. Oh, that thing looks so cool! Oh my god, I love that. We're only gonna see it for like two seconds. Okay, I want one of those eventually. Not that we need more fire types, but I just want one. Are you just gonna keep using U-turn? Oh no, razor blade. Wait, super effective. What? Fairy type? No, steel maybe? Might be steel. That's okay. Faye is tanky. Strike yawn. Oh, it's the it's the zappy one. Hmm. I mean that thing is cool, but kinda derpy. I like the idea though. Zappy dragon. Uh, what else you got? Aragon. Wingon's evolution. Whoosh. No, oh, we still got one more. <laughs> uh, Frugon. Oh, this is the dragon fruit one? Yeah. Oh, Leech I'm really glad he didn't start with that one. Oh, we missed. Uh oh. This is gonna be less than ideal now. Come on, Faye. Oh wow, he has Earthquake against fire types too. Interesting. That's alright. Yep, and this is why I thought Faye was a good idea. My dragons were not enough. Because he was a good idea. That settles it. You've beat me. Congratulations, you've defeated all the Elite Four. Now, head through that door to the Rakota Pokemon Champion. He'll be waiting for you. Good luck. Okay, so we know the champion's a guy. That's about all I know. Um, and who should we lead with? Marjorie? Fang? Oops, that's not it. Uh, let's do another save, just in case anything goes wrong. Da da da. Who are you? You look relatively normal. Well, well, what do we have here? So your shade. I see you've managed to defeat the Elite Four and make it all the way to me. Hmm. My name is Jax, and I'm the Pokemon Champion of Rakoto. You'll battle me. Final this title. If you win, you'll be the new Pokemon Champion of Rakoto. If you lose, well, I keep that title. Pretty simple. This is the toughest battle you will ever have. Get ready, because this will not be easy. Uh, I was kind of hoping it would be somebody we knew. A little disappointed that it's not somebody we know. Um, Lunate first? Yeah, sure, why not. I kind of like it when, you know, you've met the champion at some point during your playthrough. It's a little overdone, I guess, by now, but... Oh good, so you're Psychic Poison. So Ghost would be good, Dark Pulse would be fine. Oh, I don't know what type you are when you Mega Evolve, though. Same type, or do you turn Dark Poison or something? No, it's a neutral hit, so... Oh, okay, now he's ghost type. Oh, don't do that. What? Why are you- We speed tie? Oh man, that's not fun. Okay, well I need somebody faster. So zip. Get your butt in there. Plus Shadow Ball's not gonna do much against you. Uh, Aurora Eye. That was the, um, fairy ice, wasn't it? Uh, some Marjorie. That's a little, like, mouse thing, right? Yeah. No, stop being faster than me. Stop critting me, too. Wait, are you not? Fairy ice? You're I oh, ice electric, isn't it? Right. 
Right. Okay. Uh -hmm. Oh, that's not good. Oh, what do we do? Uh, I'm gonna put Zip in. Oh, that was a bad idea. Okay. Somehow didn't die. Uh, lightning Strike would hit it. Might kill it? Yeah, okay. Good. Slowly getting there. Uh, Ella Stomp. Ground type. I think it's just straight ground? Not sure. Oof. Yeah, we're gonna be asleep. So we are gonna use our flute. Which I don't remember where that one was. Down here somewhere? Fusion sleep. Yeah, there we go. Okay, wake up. Now it's got muddy water. That's what you keep hitting me with. That's okay, we're just gonna keep healing off ya. Okay, so Vincent's asleep. Gotta keep that in mind if we're gonna send him back in at any time. Uh, top of Blaze. Fang. Haven't seen Fang for a little bit. Haven't even Mega evolved him yet. Let's get on that then. Also, the elite or the champion's only what level seventy-ish. It's not bad at all. I think we overleveled, but yeah, that's okay. We're still getting our butts kicked, apparently. And small again. Uh, let's do Marjorie, because both our electric types are not doing so hot. All right, Marjorie, please be faster. That was not faster. Okay. I know who is faster, though. It's a little zip. Bringing out his A game today, apparently. Oh, a Conberry. Yeah, now he's dead. That's okay. We're just gonna put Faye in. Can probably, s well, probably can't sweep everybody with Faye, but he's pretty dang strong. Put it that way. And he's gonna level up off this. Yay. Level you up. Okay, last Pokemon? Fan sheet. Ghost? Oh yeah, this thing. Pain split. Oh, you're just gonna be a trolley son of a gun, aren't you? Yeah, it's gonna use pain split again. Hmm. Let's go for Mystic Wave then, see if we can't lower its special defense. Attack fell. Okay. Just keep using Mystic Wave, I guess, because it's just gonna keep using Pain Split. It's faster than us, huh? That's its strategy. It's a pretty solid strategy, actually. <laughs> keep using that until we're super weak and then one shot us. Aw, oh, so close. Okay. If it uses Pain Split again, we should be able to get it. Yep. Alright. That's a rough one. I'm also glad he didn't start with uh, Fan Sheet. And there we did. Everything has an end. We beat him. Well, looks as if you win. You're the new Pokemon champion of Rakota. Hmm. I should be disappointed, but really, I'm happy. I got to battle a powerful trainer and was defeated. I've had the Pokemon champion title for a long time now. I was starting to think there was no one worthy enough to make it this far, but I see now you are worthy. Congratulations, Shade, you're now the Pokemon champion of Rakoto. Please, go to the Hall of Fame. Oh. We did it, you guys! Yay! We became champion. Yep, Hall of Fame here. Time to record all our beautiful Pokemon.
Moon Ape. Look at them all. Got all our blue ones up top. <laughs> and the mishmash of stuff on the bottom. Woo woo, welcome to the Hall of Fame. And there's us. League champion, congratulations, 35 hours. Not terrible. Not great either. <laughs> but we did it. And now we get some credits. So here we get to see the people that we got to meet in the house. Oh, we get different backgrounds here too. Well, that was a fun game. I have a feeling there's a lot of post-game though because we saw zero legendaries throughout our playthrough. I mean, for catching we saw zero legendaries. So clearly we have to catch um, the two, uh, what is it, Lunaro, Solaran, and Cell Ants. And then anything else that there would be? There's probably some, oh, um, Healthia and Pelusion. So we'd have to catch those ones. Yeah. So let's see what happens after this, because I don't want to end this just yet. I feel like I'd kind of be cheating you guys if we didn't go catch the legends, at least the title legends, uh, Solaran and Lunaro. So we'll at least do that. Might have to be next episode, but... Do 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 do. There's a lot of people that worked on this though, wow. Good job all you guys. You made a pretty solid game. My biggest gripe with this game probably would be spelling. There's a lot of typos, um, but that's something that just bothers me personally. Uh, the designs were good. They were a little iffy in the first half. Some of them were like kind of eh, but they got a lot better by the second half. So yeah, and I like all the shinies and stuff. That's always fun. Oh good, everybody's healed. Uh, actually, you know what? Lunate, stay up front. All right, somebody tell me what to do. Champions have to rest as well, Shade. You can have a break in your room. Or just rest here, because you're my mom. Do you have anything to say? Someone had told me once that one of my kids will be a well-known gym leader and one will be the champion of our region. I would have said that they're totally crazy. Okay, nobody's accosted me yet. Uh, is Rodney here? Nope. Sure isn't. Ah, if it isn't the champion of the Rakota region, welcome back to your hometown, Shade. Okay, the professor said he had goodies for us. It's also this guy. Route 19. Oh yeah, we haven't been to the jewel mine yet either. We never did get to do that. Uh, actually, let me see. What is Route 19? Where does that lead? Oh. Is it supposed to be a connector? That'd be pretty neat if it could loop around like that. That'd be super cool. I kind of like loop maps, um, like in Unova. I thought that was pretty fun. Okay, give me goodies. If you need anything, you know where I am. If you register me with your Poke Gear, you can call me anytime to rate your Poke. Oh, I haven't. I never registered him. <laughs> Whoops. Look who's visiting my lab, the new champ of Rakoto. Nice to meet you, Shade. It's perfect timing to have you here. You'll see, we studied the elemental stones quite a long time, and I think we found out how they work. They are part of the elemental temples where Team Solar and Lunar found them. There are some statues in the temples with a spot where you can put the stones. But we couldn't find out what we have to do after that, so nothing happened at all. There must be something special which allows the stones to react with the temple in some way. I thought about it, and I think this task is something for our new champion, don't you think? Here are all five elemental stones. I hope you find a way to get them to react with their temples. Wait a minute. If I have all these stones, could I theoretically just go be like... Oh, go put them in that spot, summon all the legends again. I feel like you shouldn't just be giving me these. Could be a bit problematic, but I do appreciate that we're just gonna get all these legendary stones. Also, do these all summon legends? Are there like five other legends that we don't know about? Cause that's nuts. The nearest temple is in Dolphin Forest, maybe you'll give it a try. Okay, um... Can I phone him from here? 
Oh, look at that, guys. We have a phone now. We never had this before. Could we register trainers this whole time, too, and I've just never talked to them? No, come over and talk to me. Is that the gift you had for me? Or do we actually get Pokedex completion gifts? Oh, there's Ronnie. Hey, Shane, I just watched you, your win over on the Elite... Yeah. I just watched your win over the Elite Four on the TV. Congratulations that you're an Elite Champion. But I wasn't surprised, really. You really are a talented trainer. Do you remember your first Pokemon battle? It was ours. Although that was a long time ago, it's still my favorite battle of all time. Wonder why? It's because from there that I understood that not only was I building my friendship with my Pokemon, but I was also doing that with you and Kira. That's something I plan to cherish. Aww. Roddy's so nice. And the best way to do that is to challenge you to a rematch. Ah, but not here. I've heard about some new areas which you can visit soon. They're in the east of Sultry Town. So you don't have to walk far. Rumors have it they'll open them very soon. Maybe before that happens, you should visit Kira in Mossy Town. You'll find me somewhere there then, okay? Ah, before I forget, for winning the league, I have something for you. It's a Pokemon egg. You don't have room in your party. Oh. Okay. You already know what will hatch from the egg? Do I? So as I said, I'll surely... I will go to the newly opened areas in the east of Sultry Town. You'll find me there. Wait, let me update your map and your Pokemon. No way, we actually get updated maps? No, did they add the route? Oh my god, you guys. Look at this. There's like three or four or five new- What is this? Oh my god, this is fantastic. Okay. I love this so much. You have- oh. Tropic Cave. Oh, and then it connects to Cascade. Okay. So we get Tropic Cave, Route 20. Connects to the Jewel Mine, Route 21, and Route 19. Oh, okay. Uh, first things first. Computer? Is there one in here? Yeah. It does circle now. This whole thing is a giant loop. Kind of a double loop, actually. I love it. That's super neat that it just, like, updates after you finish the game. It's like, hey, there's a bunch of new areas you can visit. Oh, I love that. Dang, game. Still impressing me. Ah, yes, Rodney gave me something to hand over to you. Okay, what is this Pokemon egg? What do I know what it is? Ah, uh, it's a starter. So this is how we're gonna get all the starters, I guess. I'm assuming Kira's gonna give me the grass one. That's his, what, Salatad? Is that the first stage? So that's neat. We're gonna get all the starters that way. Switch. Throw you an extra our uh, guppish egg that we never did hatch because it's still ridiculous. Okay, so first things first, I guess we visit Mossy Town. Talk to Kira, get the other starter egg. And then we go, what, east of Sultry, he said? So yeah, there's a lot of stuff still going on. So we definitely can't end this here. And we got those five stones, so we have to visit temples too. Um, so I have no idea how many more episodes this is going to be. I'm guessing at this point now, though, it's probably going to be more than one. Because there's quite a bit still going on that we got to do. So thank you guys for watching. We beat the Elite Four this episode. And we're going to start doing some post-game stuff next week.